Okay. So, today we're doing whatever quest this lady gives us. For those of you who have been following along with the walkthrough that I'm making, welcome back. I pulled some gear out of my bank that I made with a different character. So I'm actually equipped decently. It's all high elf style because my character's a high elf and I decided, hey, why not? Let's match that. So let's talk to Gathwen. Please, I need your help. My master's life is in danger. Why? I'm part of an expedition from Eagle's Strand. While we explored the Temple of the Morning Springs, the dead began to rise. The others fled, but my master never emerged. Aurelian taught me to know when I should ask for help. And what well, do I'm you... asking. And what do you expect me to do? Two magical wards seal the temple, marked by emblems of a scorpion and a spider. If you can keep the undead away while I disrupt the wards, we can search for Aurelian together. How about it? Okay, I guess I can do that. I have no doubt Aurelian can protect himself. But if he's trapped inside, we need to get him out. Okay, Tears of the Two Moons. Alright, why the hell were you inside of a temple? My master and I had little to do after the shipwreck. When the locals mentioned a temple where the fountains never run dry, we leapt at the chance to investigate. Ilsil insisted on leading, of course. He's studying the Morning Stone at Eagle Strand. Ah, so you've met him. My master calls him Eel Kill. Something about an experiment gone wrong many years ago. The morning stone you saw came from this temple. Eelsil was barely able to remove it before the undead fell upon us. Did you find out anything useful? Aurelian thought it could be used to control the weather. Perhaps prevent another hurricane. Eelsil disagreed, of course. He insisted on studying it further at Eagle's Strand. Makes sense. Are you leading the way or am I? I am. Okay. see for such a long time. Only a fool can't see the hurricane's magical origins. But no matter. Local legends point to the Temple of the Morning Springs as a potent source of arcane mysteries. Perhaps a chance to show up these fools in the Crystal Tower. Yet Rorelian insists on a cautious approach. As he does, his fawning, appre his fawning apprentice. Do they think an imbecile? Do they think me an imbecile? They won't take the glory of discovery away from me. That probably was just a waste of time. Cool tent, though. Uh, useless book. What's in the basket? Nothing. Okay. Well, it's covered for the time that I just kind of wasted. Uh, nice temple. You talked to the what? Intricate stitching. Okay, hi. Turn back. You aren't welcome. The fuck are you? I'm whatever I wish to be. I change bodies like high elves change clothes. Though the corpses in this temple limit my wardrobe. 
What does it matter to you? Why do you trespass? We're looking for a dude named Varelium. Ah, the name for my newest outfit. His flesh sags a bit, but the power in his bones reminds me of my youth. And the robes. I'd forgotten the feel of silk upon newly won flesh. The fuck did you do? Set foot in this temple and see for yourself. Such commendable posture. I could definitely wear you in the autumn. As for Rorelian, he's fit for display under full moons all new. Give him back. I tire of this. Leave or die. It matters. I choose the second option. I can't be good. We need to get those wards down fast. Oh, yeah, I'm lagging. So I guess it's up there. Not very reassuring. Beautiful archer. Let's see if I have anything that I can assign for skill points. Nope. Oh, okay. Oh nice, there's two of them. I hate archers. the range on that slash is pretty good. Well, that's not ominous at all. Spider weaves the web around its prey. It won't keep us out for long. Okay, next. See that? Don't go in it.
Bomb Potion. I'll probably never use that because it takes too much effort to open your inventory while you're dying. Um, weird banners. Irish, I would appreciate if you guys just stopped showing up. That would be great. It would probably make my job too easy, though. Oh, hey. How's it going, bro? There we go. He's dead. Next. Again, not ominous at all. Very inviting. Scorpion's poison courses through its prey. Much better. Oh great, we're going in catacombs, that means more dead people. Skeleton. Stay dead. I guess I'll get this guy. There we go. And... Nice door. No interest. Okay. So, that happened. Wow, quick load. I like it when that happens. Um, I see no enemies and no loot. This is probably a boss room. Oh, observation one: This catacomb is full of corpses, and not one of them a kaji. Each appears to have died in battle, yet special attention and care was provided to preparing their bodies. Whoever constructed this place must really respect death immensely, even that of their enemies. Yeah, I screwed up when the line's on that, I know. Um, I don't get it, what am I supposed to do with that? I see. Complete the pattern. Full waxing, full waxing. The cycle of the two moons seems to be the key to dispersing the barrier. I need to speak with you. Okay, what do you want? When we entered the temple, that skeleton made it sound as though Aurelian was in grave danger. I won't let vague threats keep us from my master. But Aurelian is too important to lose. Perhaps we should think before we act. What's so special about Aurelian? The Dominion relies on Aurelian for his sound judgment. He's taught countless students the ways of Magicka, including some of the Queen's own advisors. 
His role in the invasion is paramount for our future success. If anything were to happen to him... I'll do what I can. Thank you. We should keep moving. Yeah. Ooh. Central ruins. Fancy. We found the morning stone on that pedestal. Wait, that's Aurelian. What's he doing up there? Looking like a boss fight. Ears that large and you still don't listen. Perhaps you need a few alterations. There was a time when the sound of Uldor's voice commanded the terror of thousands. What's an Uldor? Why, I am. I'm Uldor. I see your dominion teaches you nothing of my people. I shouldn't bemoan your ignorance. You fools ended centuries of captivity when you removed the Morning Stone. What is it? Never mind that. Ah, oh, shit. I believe I'll keep him. At least until my summoning ritual wears him through. You see, undead are also... babes. But I'm willing to adorn myself with hundreds of tawdry outfits in order to collect the more colorful garb of Eagle Strand. Not happening. <laughs> then drown in a sea of bones. Don't see how that would work. There's too many air pockets. Leave Aurelian for now. We have to disrupt the summoning ritual. I'll destroy the bone piles if you keep the undead at bay. in the circle. Keep the undead away from me. I'm guessing that guy was some kind of uh, lich who didn't get to keep his body or something. Bird, get down, get out of here. Okay. It's working! I'll weaken the next circle! Yeah, yeah. Chase the freaky dude. There we go. Good job. Hello. Uldor, 
I command you, by the tears of the two moons, return to your prison. Ah! That will hold me for long. Um... What? You're Gathwin's ally, yes? Please, disable these traps so she can make it to us safely. Skimmers waggered a week sal wagered a week's salary that I couldn't spend a night in this place. Nearly swallowed his whiskers when I said I'd do it. The tomb is sealed behind me. I thought I heard someone's voice, but it, it had to be Skimmer trying to get out of the bed. It's a little scary in here. I lit a few candles, but that just made the shadows leap around. It doesn't matter, I'll have the last laugh when I'm chugging double rum what with Skimmer's money. Alright. What's in the backpack? Cool. Um, okay, what's up? Despite all my knowledge, Uldor's influence over me was absolute. I'd be little more than a puppet without your timely intervention. You hurt? Oh, only my pride. But we have a more pressing matter. As Uldor sensed my thoughts, I could sense his. He plans to overwhelm and enslave Kanathi's roost with an undead horde by the next dawn! Shit. Uldor was a powerful Malmo wizard who learned to separate his spirit from his body. Even in death, he can wear hundreds of mindless forms at a time. Thankfully, I know his weakness. Well, the fact he's a Maramur explains why he's a prick. The Morning Stone's endless water supply tied Uldor's spirit to his body. When Eelsil removed the Morning Stone from the temple, he set Uldor free. Once again, Eelsil's sloppy methods nearly caused the death of me. How do we restore the prison? These gems focus the Morning Stone's power. Uldor had me remove them from his tomb. I propose Gathwin recovers the Morning Stone from Eagle Strand. Meanwhile, we restore Uldor's prison. <laughs> Simple enough. Sounds good, let's go. Master, I know what you're planning. I won't let you throw your life away. What? Aurelian's plan is to let Uldor possess him. They'll both be sealed in the tomb forever. But it doesn't need to be this way. Seal me inside. Why? Aurelian is too important for the Dominion to lose. Besides, we both saw how the summoning ritual weakened my master. Oh. Please, help me convince Aurelian. I will gladly seal myself in the tomb to spare my master. Uldor is a threat to all on this island. Fine, have it your way. Thank you. I should prepare myself. Let's go. Catherine, I beg you to reconsider. You're too important, Aurelian. If the Dominion lost you, we would be lost. Then I'll recover the Morning Stone. Farewell, my dearest friend. Farewell, that Aurelian. That was great. Okay, let's go. Hey, you're perfect. You. I won't wear a poisoned outfit. Uldor, my master was a fool to doubt your power. I'll help you wreak the vengeance you seek, if you allow me. Such a spectacular willing garment. Very well. I can't fight him for long. Quickly! Place the tears of the two moons in the pedestals! Wretched fool! I'll turn your friend to ash! Stay away from those pedestals! Seriously, renovate, buddy. You look to have some structural problems. And you might want to get rid of those vines. These 
little uh, columns. You might want to make them complete. There we go. You worthless rag! This mm -hmm. tomb can't mm -hmm. hold me forever. Oh, boy, I can just walk in. Water weakens all door. But I can't hold him for long. Quickly, go to Aurelian. Tell him I did what must be done. And what about you? I know Aldor will keep me alive. He far prefers a living form to the dead. Strange. How can I know this? I feel him stirring within me. Help Aurelian restore the Morning Stone. Go! While you still can. Sounds good to me. Have fun. Restore the Morning Stone, but if you're here, then Gathwin is lost to that monster. She saved the whole island. You speak truth, and yet the young should never die for the old. It is the singular travesty of war. And what are you gonna do about it? I need to record everything that happened here. Uldor's skill troubles me. Without further study, the Dominion will bear no defense against his strange capabilities. And what about your apprentice? I've rarely encountered a creature of Uldor's power. There may be a way to separate him from Gathwin, but it will take much time and study. She's not just an apprentice. She's my friend. If there's a way to free her, I swear I'll find it. Okay. Um. Not a bad bow. Please don't think me ungracious. Without your aid, I'd still be under Uldor's influence. I won't forget. I can open a portal to the temple courtyard if you wish. Please do. There you are. I'm afraid it won't remain open for long. See ya. on my way to the courtyard. Please don't think me ungracious. Without your aid, I'd still be under Uldor's influence. Do it again. I'm, there you are. I'm afraid it won't remain open for long. Shanks. There we go, it worked this time. Woohoo! Okay. this episode there like comment subscribe all that good stuff let me know if there's something you want to cover well if you, there's something you want me to cover i should say my bad and if there's something that i missed that you think i should go back and point out let me know bye